On this episode of Avian Adventures, we take a deep dive into one of the Raptor Center's favorite types of birds, vultures. Vultures are often referred to as nature's cleanup crew. They play such an important role in an ecosystem as scavengers. It's their job to eat dead things, or carrion, that are found in the environment. Because of what they eat, vultures often get a bit of a stigma. Many people think vultures are gross and dirty because they eat roadkill, but that's not the case at all. Vultures actually have some pretty cool ways to clean themselves after eating a meal. You may be wondering, how do vultures stay clean? One way vultures keep themselves clean is by having a bald head. Just imagine sticking your head into a deer carcass and then pulling it back out again. Your hair would be full of all kinds of gross things and it would take forever to clean it all out. And nobody wants that, including vultures. It's much easier to clean a bald head than a head full of feathers. After they are done eating, Vultures will rub their heads and beaks on branches, rocks, and anywhere else to clean off any juices or pieces that get stuck to their face. This behavior is called feeking. Once the head is all clean, vultures will find a nice sunny spot that's usually high off the ground to sun themselves. They will stretch their wings out and let the sun warm their feathers. Sunning actually serves a couple different purposes. The first one is to simply warm them up. I mean, who doesn't like sitting in a nice warm sunbeam, especially on a chilly day? The other purpose is to try and shed off any pesky parasites that may have jumped on the vulture while they were eating. As the feathers warm up in the sun, the parasites will fall off. Vultures, like most birds, will also preen their feathers to make sure each one is in excellent condition. The last thing vultures do to stay clean is to poop on their legs. Yes, you heard that correctly. Vultures will poop on their legs to stay clean. Vulture poop is highly acidic and acts like hand sanitizer. Any bacteria that may have gotten on their feet while they're eating doesn't stand a chance against vulture feces. Defecating on their feet also helps cool them off on a warm day. As the liquid evaporates, it cools off their skin kind of like when humans sweat. This process is called urohydrosis. Not only do vultures get rid of carcasses and stay clean while doing it, but they also get rid of diseases to keep our environment healthy. Vultures can eat different diseases and take them out of the environment completely. They have super acidic stomach acid that eliminates the bacteria before it can harm the vulture. Their stomach acid is so strong it can take out diseases such as botulism, anthrax, and cholera, all of which are harmful to humans. So next time you see a group of vultures on the side of the road, slow down as you drive by. They are busy getting rid of diseases and keeping our roadsides clean. And we think that is definitely worth slowing down for. And if you see roadkill on the road, you can also pull over, if it's safe to do so, and move it into a ditch. This is a much safer spot for vultures to enjoy a meal. Good. That's it for this episode of Avian Adventures. Hopefully you now share our passion for nature's very own cleanup crew. See you next time. <laughs>